Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. This is Brian with Super Techs, and we got another one for you. Have you ever gotten this C2557 code? Well, we did, and it ended up turning out to be the black toner motor, the one in the very back. So let me sh take this toner bottle out for you and just kind of show you. Um, basically, no toner was being dumped into there, even though it does look like there's some in there. It was empty. We swapped it out for the... Um, toner hopper uh, assembly and it didn't work so basically I have to take off the back and remove that motor so here's a video of me showing you this I'm gonna shut up now I'll chime in at the end be sure to like comment subscribe and I'll see you guys at the end of the video
Okay, and that is the black toner motor assembly, not to be confused with the toner hopper motor assembly for the black unit. We ended up changing it and it ended up working perfectly fine. As you can see here, I got the machine um, somewhat back together where it's working and the C2557 code is gone and the copies look great. So everything's running uh, pretty good. I'm just going to put everything back together. I got mostly everything back. Um, so if you have that code, it's not necessarily that motor, but in our case it was. We ended up changing the toner hopper assembly, that didn't work. Developing unit, that didn't work. Uh, so then the only thing that we were left with was uh, the black toner motor in the back and it ended up fixing it for our case. So with that said, I'm going to go ahead and end this video. Please like, comment, subscribe. Thank you so much for watching guys. We really appreciate it and we'll see you on the next video. Bye bye.